Hi guys, welcome back to another FST video. Today we are gonna get out of this parking lot and see if FST is gonna take us to our destination. I am just gonna put the FST on. Uh, so it is gonna reverse now, look at this. So it's reversing on its own. Perfect, oh wow, look at this. Guys, coming out of the parking lot and making the turn so it's end to end guys we don't have to do anything at all and you'll see the car will be taking us to our destination without us doing anything and we will be going on the highway as well so let's test that out too it's changing the lanes very naturally as you can see So I am on the version 13.2.1 and with this version there are a lot of new updates and I covered majority of those in my prior video uh, so you know do check some of the videos out guys if you haven't already. So we are completely like working on the AI infrastructure now and everything is enabled by the this Cortex cl cluster which is like five times training compute and you know having the capabilities of scaling to that level. So this is amazing right so that's uh, one of the biggest thing and some of the other things too which i covered in the past so um basically we don't have to do anything at all just put the address in sit in the car and the car will take you anywhere you want to go now without you doing anything at all so you know notice that we just put the address in the parking lot the car reversed and now we are on our way so we are also going to be hitting the highway in this drive so you know We'll be driving on highway for a bit too. So let's see how it's going to drive on the highway. So for highway, uh, again, it's also like uh, going to give you the options for different pro speed profiles now. Uh, the chill profile, hurry mode, and I think the other one is called standard. Standard is the middle one. So I am on the hurry profile. I keep it that way and I switch between, um, you know, standard and hurry. Hurry is gonna basically keep you in the fast lane. It's gonna change lanes aggressively and like, you know, again, it's gonna be the fastest, most aggressive FSD that is out there. But then standard is more of like your traditional, like, you know, it's gonna stick to, you know, middle lanes and not gonna be changing lanes quite frequently. My automatic set speed set setting is on and the offset I have uh, at 40%. And I did cover that in my previous video. I play around with that setting. So right now it is at 40%. And then you can also use the scroll wheel uh, to you know set your maximum. So I am gonna set the maximum at 73. And it's gonna stick. So, so far so good. Look at this, we are changing the lanes again. We are coming in the middle lane. And we are on the hurry mode. So something that was not there in the previous versions of FST, it would always stick to the fast lane and would not basically come in the middle lane or like, you know, try, try to drive in, you know, the slower lanes as well. So now this is like, guys, we are, I'm going to say, uh, we are very close to getting the super unsupervised FST at some point. I think we are almost there. I mean, you know, I am not going to be surprised if next year they announce that like you know FSD is now unsupervised. Just sit in the car and it will take you anywhere while you're playing games or doing something like that although it's not recommended. Uh, you should still pay full attention while you drive and I do that too and I mentioned that in all my videos too. Even when this is going to become full supervised still pay full attention because in the end uh, person behind the wheel is responsible for anything right so i do trust this technology but like again still it's it's uh you it, it's 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 uh, a machine right <laughs> so you should basically be ready to take over at any point but i am stoked and i am really really speechless how good this have become this year tesla's fsd team is doing a great job you know they keep on coming up with these great updates and making this thing better and better every single time look at this so we are getting off the highway now yeah we're taking the exit 
I didn't do anything at all. It's all on its own, guys. This is my second drive today. Uh, I didn't, I didn't uh, touch the yoke pretty much to steer the car. I have just been pressing this button and that's it. Just put the address in, press this button, you're good to go. So this is another tricky one. We have reached a stop sign and this is like a busy state highway kind of thing. So let's see how, how long we have to stay here on the stop sign. It's moving forward, moving forward. It's going down now again. And here we go. Guys, I would also say this, like if you ever get a Tesla, don't get a Tesla without the FSD. You are not getting, you know, a full experience if you don't have the full self-driving. Once you start using this, you will never go back. So again, I'm gonna tell you like, you know, before I actually used the FSD, I was not a big fan of it. I was like, you know, it's just gonna be a gimmicky kind of thing. But uh, over the last year, I have basically come to a conclusion. Sorry, I just was playing with my offset. But I came to a conclusion then uh, that this thing is by far much, much superior than what I thought. And like, by while we are talking about this, look at this. So we were approaching the stoplight and we stopped very gradually. So that's another thing that hits, hits me like, you know, and it's improved over time that we're not like making abrupt, abrupt kind of stops or like making harsh movements uh, when picking up from the stoplight. So it's very gradual, like pretty much like uh, how a human driver would drive, even better in some cases. Again, we are going to be changing the lanes. Going to be taking this exit here. There's construction going on too. So again, look at this, braking has been very, very gradual. I am ready to take over at any point, but I don't have to do anything. So far, I haven't experienced any any dangerous maneuvers by FST on this version. And the more I use it, the more confidence I have been gaining that this is by far, by far the best version of FST so far. So let's make this turn, guys, and I am going to stop the video after this because I think we're very close to our destination. So let's just quickly make this turn or let FSD make this turn. And there we have it. So guys, I'll be posting more content. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already and do check some other content out and keep your feedback coming. I do read your comments and based on your comments, I will be testing a few more things as well. So on that note, stay safe and goodbye. I'll see you in the next one.